Hi guys, this is Andrew at Flory PB, and this is going to be a quick video to uh, go over some of the changes to the new matrix boards. This is for the LCD frames, and this one's for the LED frames. So if you have a three button board with two button holes and then an eye, a hole for the LED, or if you have one button up top like the older stuff, and one hole at the bottom for the LED. Uh, minor changes happened here just to help improve fitment because uh, there's a couple, you know, more niche use cases such as um, an aardvark frame. I've reconfigured these post someone installing one doing a little modification to fit in an aardvark frame. I believe it'll also fit in like a free flow single trigger frame. I know a person had a problem trying to fit the original board in that one as well. So this new setup, kind of keep it just when I put them flat, it kills the color out for some weird reason. But uh, so that they've been changed a little bit, altered a little bit in size, slimmed down in order to fit into a little, a little better into more frames, more of the uh, the, the oddball frames that aren't pretty pretty standard stuff. Um, besides that, I've included. Let me bring it up. Uh, I've included, included the capacitor ports like uh, my Timmy board plus minus so you can put a capacitor there if you want to use it with the higher powered solenoid for some kind of uh, different use case just in case you, you want to use one of these or a matrix frame with uh, a different kind of marker or something gives you an option for that as well uh, besides that is everything that the Old boards did. Um, you got your four pin harness for the LEDs. You got the two dual pin. This is the battery for the LCDs, the solenoid. You have your big four pin eyes, which are like the die eyes. You have your TMC eyes. You have eggy eyes here. You have regular die eyes here, or newer style die eyes here. So you have all of the eyes on the board. You don't have to switch anything anymore. And then this, of course, is a port in case you want to move this LED somewhere for some reason, let me know. And I can give you an LED on a plug that you can move to put somewhere else for also custom applications. Oh, uh, that's it. Real quick, down and dirty video. Nothing else has changed on these other, uh, with functionality. It's just more ports, more ability to put things, and hopefully fits more into uh, to some of these weirder use cases with uh, some of these more niche, more rare frames. All right, it's Andrew Floyd PB. That's it on this one.